Think of a sports car that's completely backwards, with nothing under the hood and no trunk space, but capable of 200 miles per hour and seating for four people. What do you get? A Porsche 911. The Porsche 911 has become the benchmark for all sports cars, but it's also impossible for rival automakers to replicate thanks to its half-century-old formula of being rear-engined. Its iconic performance and unique shape has ingrained it into pop culture, with countless appearances in movies like Bad Boys, Gone in 60 Seconds, Fast Five, and Office Space. Celebrities like LeBron James, Kanye West, Rihanna, David Beckham, Jay-Z, and Beyonce have all taken orders of theirs, and comedian Jerry Seinfeld and former fashion designer Magnus Walker both have warehouses filled with their own Porsche collections. While cars are universally known to be horrible investments, 911s inexplicably maintain value and can even resell for double and triple their retail cost over time. Argentinian football legend Diego Maradona's 1992 Porsche 911 Carrera II sold for 582,000 US dollars, while a 1974 Porsche 911 RSR, once owned by Pablo Escobar, fetched $2.2 million at auction. So why own a 911? How is it so timeless? The explanation is in its instant appeal for petrol heads and collectors alike. Behind the hype, the Porsche 911. For many, the Porsche 911 has managed to cross over into many other subcultures. Sculptor Daniel Arsham has recently been working very closely with the rear engine sports car releasing not only a miniature eroded 911 cast model, but a fully functioning one-of-one -one scale size 911 as well. Puma's recent collaboration with Porsche spawned a line of sports sneakers referencing the lineage of the 911 Turbo, and LEGO even created a turbo that can also convert to the roofless 911 Targa. The long-awaited video game title Cyberpunk 2077 even featured an apocalyptically prepped 911 Turbo that highlighted the iconic shell shape of the 911. My ride. From its circular headlights and long swooping rear end, the 911 silhouette is instantly recognizable. Because the engine is found slung so far back and low, the design allows not only for storage up front, but up to four passengers, thanks to available rear seats. Newer modern models adopt aggressive lines and panels, and wings get larger as you climb the power chart from S to Turbo to the highly coveted GT3 and GT2 models. Want something even faster? Porsche offers RS models, which in fact remove things like sound insulation, air conditioning, stereos, and even carpets, instead of throwing a ton of power into the engine to push something heavy. This idea of a small, compact, lightweight sports car originated in 1963, when the Porsche 911 was first introduced at the Frankfurt Motor Show. Designer Ferdinand Ferry Porsche wanted to elevate the brand's car at the time, the 356, into something nimble and agile, but practical and useful at the same time. The original concept was known as the 901, but due to competing trademarks with French automaker Peugeot, Porsche had to switch its moniker to the 911, and thus a new standard for functional performance was born. As time went on, the 911 grew in size, power, ability, and value. The original 911, Series 930, 964, and 993 generations maintained prowess with their air-cooled engines until 1998 when Porsche introduced the 996, finally adopting a water-cooled engine that was both more robust and reliable. In 2008, Porsche introduced the 997.2 generation, which introduced the brand's lightning-quick PDK dual-clutch transmission followed by the 991.2 turbocharged engines across the entire line of Carreras, even outside of the 911 Turbo. Modern drivers will flock towards new 911 models for their enormous output and technology, but purists will continue to seek out the classic air-cooled examples, resulting in skyrocketing values for top-conditioned examples. Today, the 911 is the hyped car to own receiving praise from journalists and owners alike, and recognized as one of the top five most influential cars of the century. Pop culture continues to utilize it as the quintessential sports car. Their reliability has led to Porsche confirming that approximately 70% of all Porsche 911 sold are still on the road today. And the company's ideals and stubbornness towards subtly evolving a proven formula makes the Porsche 911 one of the most highly regarded cars ever made.
behind the hype. The Porsche 911.